Parkour, parkour, live in the edge. Parkour, parkour, kid, jump off that edge. What? <laughs> hey, what's up, guys? This is a tutorial on how to set up a Minecraft server 1.0 and the new full release of Minecraft uh, with Hamachi. If you haven't, uh, if you don't have an account yet, please register and buy it to support Minecraft because it's an amazing game and I love it. So the first two links are going to be on Minecraft.net. Just type it in and uh, you can log in if you want and if you still haven't bought it be sure to buy it okay so once you're at minecraft.net go to download it's under buy now and you're gonna wanna uh, if you haven't installed it yet just uh, if you have windows click this minecraft.exe and it'll, uh, it'll start a download and you install it and if you um, have a Mac you click this show all platforms you have it for Mac and you also have for, have it for Linux but uh, Linux is a little more complicated I've tried it before and um, to set up a server um, you click on this link this is the first two um, downloads you need click on um, you know server and uh, you want to save the file and then uh, you can exit out of that and if you haven't downloaded Minecraft yet just uh, get it for whatever platform you have now once you have downloaded that uh, head over to your downloads folder usually it's in your username and then downloads um, and then you're gonna want to find minecraft underscore server dot exe so uh, you can drag that to your desktop and um, you can make a new folder for your server I like to put it under my documents for but for this tutorial I'm gonna just create a new folder so you can drag it in there and um, you can uh, start it now if your Windows firewall comes up um, this is completely safe it's Minecraft it's a trusted program you know it's by Mojang uh, runs off of Java just allow access um, so you're gonna allow access and after that it's gonna generate a world and a server so after you're done with this uh, you're gonna wanna exit out of this and um, you're gonna wanna go over to server properties and if it's just a blank folder right click it and um, you can open with and you're gonna open it with notepad Alright, so now you're going to see a whole bunch of gibberish right here. And uh, this is basically where you're going to edit all your stuff. Not basically, just basic rules and stuff. So your server IP is what you're going to need. You're going to want to um, get into Hamachi. If you uh, haven't downloaded it yet, the uh, link will be in the description. And um, so what you're going to want to do is uh, you're going to want to start a new server. And uh, I'll show you how to do that right now. You go to network, create a new network, and then your network ID is um, whatever you want. I'm going to do mine local server, and then I'm going to create a random number on the background, like 12333. And then password, you can do whatever you want, 123, and you create it. So now you're done with that. You're going to uh, see right here on Hamachi, you open uh, the notepad again, where uh, server IP is. You're going to want to, you can either do this two ways. You can copy this IP4 address right here. It's 5.0.125.182. That's mine, but yours is different. Now uh, you can right-click right, cl right click it and copy IP4 address. You come over to uh, your notepad here and uh, paste it right here where it says right after the server IP no space in between or it'll mess it up you go to file and save alright now that uh, that's done load your server back up and um, it's gonna take a while it's preparing to spawn and um, I'll see you guys on fraps hey while you're at it go check out modagame.com it's a forum base website and it's just really great for Xbox members and PS3 members it's based on modding and um I think you uh, would like the site if you would just go try to sign up for it or just view it
Hey guys, so to get people to join your server, they're gonna have to be connected to your Komatsu server, of course, and um, you're gonna go to a multiplayer and you can give them your IP. If you still have a copy, just uh, press Ctrl V or you can copy it from Komatsu. You can do this too if they're connected to the Komatsu server, and it's going to work. If it doesn't, then um, you must have the IP wrong either in Minecraft or in your server property. And uh, yeah, that's basically about it. And uh, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up or favorite it or whatever you can to help me out. And I die.